Thank you for helping me, Lolita. You're welcome. I have a lot of free time. At least you spend it in a constructive way. I don't mind. I feel like that more and more these days. What? These are violent times and Zaro's the only one who dares fight back against the army. I guess I enjoy watching someone relaxing and enjoying themselves. Oh, yes. Oh. Uh -huh. Ah! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Do you need a room? A room? I already have one. The room on the east side of the third floor. But, but wait a minute, that's our best room. You... Oh, very good, sir. <laughs> hey, right this way, sir. Oh, you've noticed that, huh? Say, mister, you some kind of bounty hunter, huh? <laughs> Even the great Zorro wouldn't stand a chance against you. <laughs> Show me the room. Oh, uh, yes. And <laughs> this is the best room we have. Mr. Capital, it's terrible! What's the matter bursting in here? Oh, it's like I told you, sir. He's, he's here! Who's here? D -d 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 Death! I'm going to headquarters. You take care of the accounts now. <laughs> yes, sir! Hmm. Hey, where do you think you're going, huh? Stop! Stop or I'll shoot! I see. An inspector sent from head office, you say. We all know that Zorro is to blame for our business results being poor at the moment. And yet they seem to want me to take responsibility for it all. He must be here to try and find some positive proof to fire me and send me back to Spain. I can't let him do that. I can't. I don't want to go back to Spain. I want to stay here. You, you got to help me. It's really none of our concern. What? I really don't know what you're getting so upset about. You've also been embezzling money from the company, haven't you? And that makes you not only incompetent, but you're also a traitor. I'm sorry, Capital. But you've let us down, there's all your business. We don't have anything to do with it, understand? I had a feeling you might say something like that, like a rat deserting a sinking ship. You make me sick. Commander Raymond, your plan to become Governor General using stolen money is written in my secret account book. This man is looking for it. Ah, uh, so my friend, it appears we're both in the same boat. I paid someone a lot of money to get me that information. You? <laughs> I've always said, Capital, that you could buy and sell anything. It would be a shame to see so valuable an asset sent back to the old country to rot in a jail when he could be here helping me to run this country. What do you say? Mm. Secret book! Ah, ah, help! Help! Somebody help me! Ah, ah, ah. 
Ah! The account book has been stolen! Ah! What? Post a cordon right away. Yes, sir. Can we kill him? Yes. And report to head office that he was killed by Zaro. You took Capital's secret account book from the South India Trading Company. Now I would like you to give it to me. Stay out of it. It's none of your business. It is our business! That book has all the details on how Capital and his friends stole money from the poor! That's right. That book has to be made public in the interests of the people. Please, you must give it to me, now. You can leave capital to us. We'll take care of him. That's not enough. In that case... Stay back, Bernard. But Zorro! Stay back. He's too skillful. Oh, what a terrible night to be on the lookout for bandits and thieves! Whoa! Well, Gonzalez, have you found them yet? Uh, not yet, sir. Uh, don't you think... Don't you think it might be a bit late to look for the account book right now, sir? Huh? Oh! What? Uh. Huh? Lieutenant, listen! What? It's useless to try and resist me. We're trained to eliminate anything that gets in our way. waste on Zoro now. We must get after the other one. But Zoro looks as though he's injured, Lieutenant. Gonzalez! Yes, sir! Uh, I wish I knew what was going on. I've sewn up the wounds and dressed them with an ointment that my grandmother taught me how to make. So he should be all right now. Lolita. Uh, what? What happened to him? I don't know. The army was looking for him all night, but they still couldn't find him. 
Are you surprised, Lolita? Don't you talk to me, Diego. You deliberately left me out of all this. Lolita. Well, it's okay. I'm just joking. Well, half joking anyway. I'm glad to see that you are the man I once thought you to be, Diego. I always found it hard to believe that the Diego I knew could turn out to be a coward. Lolita. Um, I guess I'll take a little walk over here. Lolita, you must promise me that you will forget what you have seen here today. You must stay as you were before, as someone who knows nothing about all this. Anyone who knows Zoro's identity and doesn't report it could be executed by the army. Don't be silly, Diego. I mean, Zoro. The whole point of you becoming Zoro was to fight against that kind of tyranny, wasn't it? Well? Gonzalez and the others are coming this way! What will we do? We can't move Diego in this condition! What happened to Viento? Hey, why don't we go back now, Sergeant? Shut up! Catch Zoro, they say. Catch Zoro. But this time they want me to leave him alone. I just don't understand it. I just wish they would make up their minds. Do they want us to catch him or not? Thanks to Lieutenant Gabriel, I'll be walking around here all night now. Come on, Gonzalez. Just go home. Oh, let's take a nap here for a while, huh? <laughs> Sergeant? What are you doing, Sergeant? What we are doing is we are having a nap, soldier. Well, that's torn it. I'm sorry, sir. We've searched everywhere for him, but with no luck at all, sir. Never mind, Lieutenant Gabriel. What? It is not possible to read the account book alone. One would need the code table to decipher it, you see. Need what code table? Darrell. Sir, this is the code table. This is it? Darrell there is so weak and spineless that he would not dream of betraying me, which makes him perfect. <laughs> the perfect man to entrust with my secret accounts. And so you and I are going to guard Mr. Darrell day and night, Lieutenant, is that understood? However, Lieutenant. Huh? Even the army can't guarantee to protect somebody from a criminal who is as elusive as a shadow. In which case, it might be an idea to spend a night or two at sea. You never know the fresh air might do you good. Huh? What? Oh, <laughs> I'll get the boat ready, sir. Now, Mr. Darrow, you must show your courage, sir. The tall, dark man won't show up at the boat. Have no fear of that. He won't cut your arm off. Uh, 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 oh, to cut off my arm! Uh. Huh? Ah, there you are, Sergeant. I've been looking for you. I've got a message. You must return to headquarters immediately. Once there, you'll receive orders to escort some VIPs down to the port. Another change of plan, huh? Well, that doesn't surprise me. I wonder what kind of VIPs these people are. Uh, uh, well, should we go, Sergeant? Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. What kind of VIPs? And why are they taking them to the port? That'll be Capital. If what Bernard heard at headquarters is true, then Capital is in real danger. I can't stay here. I must go. Oh. Oh. Stay here, Diego. Oh. But Leave it to me. I have an idea. Don't worry. I'll take care of it. All right, squad. Get your rifles loaded. Right. Now, let's escort Mr. Capital to the port. Mm-hmm. Don't worry so much, Darrell. <laughs> he wouldn't dare attack us with so many guards. He'd have to be a complete fool to try it. Yes. Hmm. I can't believe he's one of them. He's too honest. Poor Jekyll being sent to such a remote place as this. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Everything was decided so suddenly, this is the only boat we could get ready in time. My men and I have the sole responsibility of escorting you, okay? Good. Stop! Stop that ship, I say! Huh? Get back! Captain Jekyll, what are you doing here, sir? 
I have received information that Zoro is on this boat, and I intend to search it. Look there! What's that? Ah! Huh? Ah! 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 Here he goes! Here he goes. Here he goes. Here he goes. I managed to keep Jekyll away from this ship so that he doesn't disturb us. Well, what's going to happen to us? We are going to sail. Ah! Huh? After him and don't let him get away! Ah! Excuse me, Miss Lolita. Have you seen Zorro? Zorro? Yes, he went that way. I'm sorry, but you told me that too easily. You wouldn't do that normally, and so... Zoro is this way! All of you follow me! <laughs> what are you... Ah! Just shut up and stay in there. I'll come back and deal with a pair of you after I've got rid of little Zoro. You betrayed us. We can't let you go. You know too much. We were gonna kill you at sea, but uh, the situation seems to have changed. Hmm? Where is he, huh? Oh, no, it's him! Mm. <laughs> mm. Little Zorro? Uh, no! No! You are a girl. You're not the real Zorro, are you? You're right. But so what? No, it's nothing. But what are you doing with us now? Why did you help us? We want to make you confess in front of all the people! All the evil you've committed in Commander Raymond's name! Is this the only bargaining chip with which we can save our lives? Whatever you think of us, we're not murderers. Even when it comes to evil criminals like you. Hmm. <laughs> huh? You're so soft. Oh. In my business, it pays to be prepared for everything, you understand? I'm sorry, but I really am not a great friend of justice. Don't move! I always make it a rule to kill my enemies so they're not around to bear me a grudge. It's the only way to survive. Drop the gun! Huh? Ridiculous woman, you're bluffing. You might think I'm bluffing, but do you want to find out? It is true that Zoro was injured in the battle with that man. But Zoro's eyes are everywhere. There is nowhere for you to escape now. Are they going to take us to the people, Mr. Capital, sir? Shut up! I refuse to be humiliated in front of a rabble. Whoa! <laughs> oh. 
Zaro! We're taking capital with us as I promised. Goodbye, Zaro. We of this South India Trading Company will not set foot in this country again. You have caused too much trouble for us, Zaro. Far too much. Goodbye. Goodbye, Zaro. Goodbye. You. I could get to like this. Capital has been taken back to Spain with all the proof they need. There's not much time. We must take all necessary measures to make this country mine. All measures? The only way I'm going to get power is to kill the Governor General. <laughs> In the next exciting episode of Zorro, Lolita now knows that Diego is Zorro. But will they be able to do anything to stop Commander Raymond's plan to overthrow the Governor General? And will Sergeant Gonzalez manage to stop the corrupt Lieutenant Gabriel? This is the final battle between good and evil. Everyone is called upon to do their part. It's all or nothing, success or failure, and life or death for Zorro!